So my fears came true <laughs> last night while the video was rendering. The power went out for, I guess, like a quick minute. And so I would get up this morning to upload it. And of course, it didn't finish the render. So it's in the rendering now. Um, but you guys will have already seen it by this time. Hopefully, hopefully, that would be weird to see the next day's vlog before the other day's vlog. Wow. Okay. Anyway, let me stop getting confused. <laughs> let me get stuff straight. Let's skip through the intro. See you guys on the other side. First appointment of the day is over. And actually, I had a cancellation this morning, but I called somebody else and I was able to get work. That's awesome because when people cancel, I, and I gotta figure out guys, I really gotta figure out what to do. I'm, I don't wanna say everybody because some people are like fantastic. Some people are great, but there's a handful of people, there, that's how I'll say it. There's a handful of people that don't think that my time is worth anything. So they like don't show up to appointments. They don't call to cancel. And it's, it's really annoying because this is what I do. This is how I make my living. If you cancel, then I could have filled your time with somebody else, possibly, or or I, I don't know. I'm just rambling right now and ranting. I'm this is my ramble rant. Yeah. So it's kind of like, wow, should I like get a start getting a deposit? But then again, it's like you know people aren't going to want to put down a deposit, and that could actually deter a lot of business. Um, if I have like a cancellation fee or something like that, then I I don't know. I don't know what to do. Do you guys have any suggestions? Let me know. Look at this guys, this is beautiful weather. This is one reason why I love Washington so much. Look at the green, look at the evergreen trees. Because we are the evergreen state, did you know that? We are, we are the evergreen state. Even when the whole thing burns up in the summertime because of the drought, we're still the evergreen state. Not the charcoal state. We actually had a lot of pine trees die this year. Um, Oh, is that one? No, it's not. Um, simply because it was just so dry and we're not used to it being so dry. I had to emphasize that again because I realized how much I emphasized it the first time. <sighs> so the vlog is uploading. Yes, I can stop stressing about it. I don't know why I stress so much. And now we take this time out for a mini rant with Troy. If you're talking to somebody face to face and you go up to him and say, hey, I've got a question. Um, what were you doing last night? or whatever the question is. The question's not important. Um, so that makes sense, right? Because you're right there. You're, you're talking to the other person. But if you're texting somebody, Facebook messaging, tweeting, snapping, whatever other social media <laughs> that you're out there doing. So let's say you text somebody and you say, I have a question. That's it, I have a question. You don't continue to ask the question because that would be like, that would make sense to put it all in the body of that. So it's like, I have a question. So the, the receiving person is like, um, they have a question, okay, okay. So you wait, <laughs> you wait for them to ask the question. And you wait and you're thinking like, okay, you've got my attention, what's the question? You wait like five minutes and then you get another text. Hello? Yes, I'm right here. Ask your question. Oh my gosh. It just drives me nuts. It drives me nuts. You say, hey, I've got a question. And you continue the question because the person's going to get the message. It's not like they're not getting the message. Ugh. Okay, rant over, but that was funny. It's funny because if you think about it, it makes sense. And I just poked myself in my eye, but you guys didn't catch that. All right, guys, appointments are over. It's time to get the rest of the Halloween stuff down and out of the yard and get this puppy mowed. Got to mow this yard, man. So then I tell you what, man, no dang mow this yard, man, no lawnmower and cut, cut, my man, mow. <laughs> that was good. I guess I'm a burrito. I am a burrito because I am what I eat. So I got burritos there, and I'm not done mowing the yards yet. Ah, the front yard is done. This might be the last time I mow them this year, which would be really outstanding. <laughs> Puffy! Puffy! Here, show paw. I'm not sure if you guys can see the green tinge in her paws because I'm mowing the grass and she's staining herself. She's stained. You're a musical group, you're stained. Trying to uh, beat the rain and the darkness. And apparently the Buffy too. See that? You see that? Okay, how about now? Do you see that now? There she is, there she is. I did it. I beat the darkness and the rain. 
as the last little bit of daylight way down there goes away and uh, we just saw some Christmas lights and we're gonna make a second pass to show you the Christmas lights again yeah I know Christmas lights right isn't it customary to like only put them up like the weekend after Thanksgiving here they are look at that way too early way way too early all right so we're going to the store are we going to the store Go for a walk, go for a ride, go for a ride. What? Go for a ride? I'm going to destroy the Christmas tree with my tail. Oh, now wouldn't that be funny? Well, I mean, not really. Ooh, and it's not a Christmas tree either. It's still a Halloween tree. Sorry, my bad. Ready to go? We're gonna go. In three, two, one. <laughs> Whoa, it worked. Dang, I should do that more often. We were just like transported into the truck. Wasn't that weird? Is that the weirdest thing? It's just like poof and you're here. Can you say poof? Go poof and you're here. Poof. Well, that's, a, that's not poof, but that'll do. Buffy. Laser. Laser. She's like, I see you holding the pen in your hand. I'm not stupid. I'm a smart dog. I'm not like some other dogs. Some other dogs might fall for this. I'm not falling for this. Oh, wait. What's that? Oh, oh, I see that. What is that? Oh, what is that? What is that? What is that? Oh, wait. It's over there now. Oh, it's in the kitchen. You're too smart for the pen. Oh, look at the pen. What is that? Ah, oh, what is that? What is that? It's over here. And now it's over here. Oh, wait. Now it's over here. Oh, wait. It's working. It's working. Whew. It's working. And she's like, um, no, I see the pen. I see the pen. It's in your hand. You tricked me again. All right. Smart dog. It's an upside down Buffy. Smart dog. Showered, relaxed. I want to sit down with the dog. And we're going to watch iZombie. I recorded it from last night or whenever it was on. Um, oh, shoot. The American Horror Story is on tonight, isn't it? I'll watch it tomorrow. Unless it's on tomorrow and then I'll watch it Friday or Saturday or something like that. Um, so anyway, we're going to watch that. And there was something else I want to tell you guys. Can't remember what it was. Huh. I'll come way back here so you guys can't see it, but I'm doing finances right now. And it almost, oh, you think this is for you, huh? It almost makes me want to just shove a huge marshmallow in my mouth and go, oh. Where can I find a huge marshmallow, though? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're going to the store. Are we going to the store? Go for a walk? Go for a ride? Go for a ride? What? Go for a ride? All right, so we're going to the store. Are we going to the store? Go for a walk? Go for a ride? Go for a ride? What? Go for a ride? I'm going to destroy the Christmas tree with my tail. Oh, you're so sweet. Oh, now, that <laughs> oh, now that, that was priceless. That was awesome. Are we going to the store? Go for a walk? Go for a ride? Go for a ride? What? Go for a ride? Why do dogs do that? Why do they like, huh? 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 Are they trying to get, like, listen better or something? What? What is going on when they do that? I don't know. I'd like for you to tell me, but you can't talk. Ladies and ghouls, it is time for COC as I mess up my already messy hair because I really don't care. Wow, I've been rhyming a lot of things recently. Let's start off with Tony Fredrickson. Wonder how many Hellions were screaming pyramid at you. <laughs> Staring contest. Ready and go. Michael Gearhart, you sir are a haunter. Any lady who doesn't understand this will not understand a million little strange nuances of a haunter. Don't waste your time on them. <laughs> Wondering Sharon, let your Halloween pride fly if you dare, or don't you dare over the tombstones. If someone doesn't like them, kick them to the curb. <laughs> that barb girl. Let it all hang out. All haunters do. My bedroom is haunt storage. My living room is haunt storage. My dining room is haunt storage. I know I'm not the only one. And Emerald Gypsy Heart says hi guys surgery went well at the writing of this i am in good spirits and hopefully i will go home on thursday awesome so so cool i'm not going to read the whole comment but triv 27 dude i love your idea of the haunt um if you guys want to take a look at that do so uh, take a look at yesterday's vlog it is freaking awesome 
I am going to go into it a little bit though. Uh, he says uh, set up the facade like I did last year and have the little gypsy thing and have that go into the basement and then in the basement basically block the exit, the normal exit of the, of the basement and then, excuse me, have like a caved in wall with like a tunnel going through it. Itchy forehead, that's not a part of the plan but I'm sure if you hit your head on, on the low ceiling, it might be. Gosh, I just threw that in there. But no, Tree of 27, I love your idea. Branson Haunted Hills, Goth Gloom Spook House did a haunt like you are talking about. I will have to look it up for you and send you the links to the videos. Awesome, that would be really appreciated. Appreci I would be appreciative. Borgex2679, I see the hole in the prop car is getting bigger. Yeah, it is. I'm going to have to do some uh, repairs to it um, if we use it this next year. Ah, oh, DMB41 ever. Troy, your infectious attitude towards life is enough to win a lady over. Or maybe a dog. Huh. Yeah, we're not like that, though. Um, and you don't bring her into your bedroom on your first date. Well, you don't if you want a true relationship anyway. By that time, or by the time that happens, she will already know how much you love Halloween and it won't be a big deal. Adam S. says, what Luke Bryan song was playing on the radio when you were driving? I have not a clue. I don't know. I went back and I listened to it and I still didn't know. <laughs> See, every time I bring the camera out, she's like, oh, I want a piece of that. I want a piece of that. I want a piece of that. Give me a piece of that. Give me a piece of that camera. Give me give me some of that attention. Yep, yep, right there. Oh, let me sniff this real quick. And Adam Owens, today is my birthday. And I said today because he said tomorrow, and we all know that tomorrow is today now. So, <laughs> happy, I was about ready to say congratulations. Happy birthday. Oh, Jordan Winton is getting his light display up. Um, that's why he hasn't commented light lately. Merlin SK, your Movember beard is doing well, but I am about three years ahead of you. Sort of ZZ Top-ish. <laughs> That's funny. All right, guys. Happy haunting. Thank you guys for watching. See you tomorrow. Check out all the links down below. Make sure to follow us everywhere. Um, do me another favor and, like, spread the vlogs all around the world so hopefully maybe I won't have to work on cars anymore. I would surely appreciate that. Happy haunting, guys. Bye. That's some bad hat, Harry.